We're talking to American International College head football coach Art Wilkins. Coach, uh, team's been at camp for a couple weeks. How have the guys been looking so far? We look really strong on defense. Uh, we're very young on offense. We have to develop each game. Uh, it's really going to be an unpredictable season, and uh, uh, we'll see how we uh, uh, develop over the first four weeks. Now, like you said, uh, the offense is a little bit, uh, you know, it is a little bit young, a little inexperienced. Um, how much is, of a concern is that? And uh, with that being said, you also see some guys uh, at this point being able to step up into a, into a role on the team. Well, we have great potential offensively. We could be a far better offensive team this year than we were last. Rob Perrin's a great player. Uh, John Kaskowitz is doing a great job for us on the offensive line. Trevor Perryman is really an outstanding player. We have six running backs who are all pretty good. Uh, that's good news. Uh, the fact that one hasn't stood out uh, yet is a, uh, a concern. Uh, Devon LeGreer is a really good offensive uh, wide receiver, uh, big threat. Uh, but uh, we've got some uh, Richard uh, freshmen and sophomores who really have to come on for us at that position. So uh, we could be explosive before the year is over uh, if we develop. Okay. Now, uh, obviously, the defense uh, hasn't been as much of a of a concern, and it's one of the better ones in the region. Uh, could you just talk about a, a couple of those guys uh, that we can be looking for a big season out of? Well, I think we're great in the secondary. I think Alan Bush and Nathaniel Ricks are two of the best corners any place. Max Brown may be our best player. Wasu on a banjo uh, was our most improved player in the spring, and probably again our most improved player. So he's a really good player. We have. Uh, a number of players, uh, Markel Rice, for instance, that uh, can come on the field for us and do a great job in the secondary, or Keith Triplett. Uh, I think we're going to be strong in the secondary. Linebackers, Terrence Holley is a great player. Nick Abraham has been an all-conference guy for two years. Uh, George Hudson and Darius Evans are going to share the other position. We have depth there. Uh, Jay Sean Williams uh, was defensive player of the year last year. Uh, he's a great player, and uh, so I expect us to be really strong and fast on defense. Uh, we're a blitzing style defense, and uh, I think we'll give uh, people some problems. We've got AIC senior defensive back Alan Bush. Alan, this is your fourth year on the team. You're used to putting up big seasons, of people kind of shied away from you. Uh, you expecting a good uh, season production wise out of yourself? Yes, I am. Um, I'm trying to be the best corner in the league, so um, this camp, I really. Worked on my footwork, you know, my speed. As far as um, just our depth, period. Um, we're good. Nathaniel Rex is at the other corner, and um, me and him really been working this hard, like working hard. So um, we, I should be good this year. Should be good. Okay, now kind of talk about also the the safeties. We return uh, a couple guys there. Have a, a pretty strong uh, core group of guys there as well uh, to yeah. help you guys out, right? Uh, Max Brown is coming back, and he is. Uh, Extremely talented. He's excellent. He's um, a real hard worker. He comes down to hit, and uh, we, we that's a, definitely a plus in our secondary. Wasu Ali Banjo, um, it's a newcomer to uh, DBs. He's starting this year. He really worked hard during spring ball, and I'm looking to have a, a great season out of him. We're talking to AIC senior defensive lineman Jay Sean Williams. Jay, you're coming off a, a fantastic season for yourself individually. Last year you were named an All-American. You were one of the top uh, uh, sack producers, tackle for loss producers in the nation. Uh, why don't you kind of talk about what uh, that meant to you kind of on a personal level to, to get recognized nationally the way you did? It felt really good because, you know, I come from a lot of teams that I'm, like, I'm probably like the second best always. But it felt really good to, you know, actually be like the man on the team, you know, it's a person that um, like younger kids can actually look up to, you know, and see my name, you know, second in the nation in sacks in Division Two. That, that really made a lot to me, you know, like hard work does pay off at the end, so at the end of the day, you know, I'm glad and happy. All right. Now, uh, now moving on to this season. Obviously, it's a it's a new year. You got a couple new guys to be working with uh, on the D line. Why don't you kind of talk about how uh, things have been going in camp for you guys so far? Well, uh, um, we only got like one or two actually um, fr fresh guys. You know, Justin Turbo. He's a young phenom. He's he's really good as a um, redshirt freshman this year. He's gonna be first year on this field. Um, he's really good, really good. So we'll look out for number nine, Justin Turbo. And um, Akeem McFarlane, he um, played sparingly last year because he, um, he's a freshman on the field or whatever because um, Terrence Mercer was hurt, but 
He did what he's supposed to do, you know me, as a freshman, but at the end of the day, he's looking to have a lot better season this year. We are here talking to AIC senior quarterback Rob Parent. Rob, this is uh, your fourth year coming in uh, this season. You are coming off a little bit of an injury. Uh, first off, uh, tell us kind of how you're feeling. Any uh, any ill feelings from uh, from last year with uh, with that? No, nah, the injury's good. I feel great. Um, doesn't bother me whatsoever. Um, so uh, I can't really say if I have a bad game, it's not because of my phone. <laughs> All right, now uh, you guys have been in camp for a couple of weeks now. How uh, how has the team kind of been uh, looking as a as a as a whole, and uh, specifically the offense? Um, as a whole, we're pretty solid. Um, you know, going defensively first, defense is stout. We return, you know, almost all of our starters are returning players. I think they all are returning players. Um, some coming off a couple injuries, um, and they're going to be very stout. They're very good defensively. Offensively, we're young, uh, but we're full of talent. Um, so right now we're on the, uh, the keep it simple, stupid type basis where, um, you know, don't do anything too fancy. Just line up and, um, you know, do what we have to do um, and use the talent that we have and, um, and just win ball games. Now, like you said, we are a little bit young on offense, a little inexperienced. Um, have some of the guys kind of stepped up during camp uh, that you specifically want to talk about right now at, at wide receiver and running back? Um, well, at running back, you know, he's uh, he's he's. A new guy, but he's really not a new guy. We got Mayo, uh, Mike Mayo returning, uh, so he's really not a new guy. Um, so I mean, he's, he steps up. He looks pretty good. Uh, another guy who looks pretty good is Courtney Stevenson. Um, he looks good. Uh, another Long Island running back, Terrell. Uh, he looks real good. Uh, wide receiver, you know, we got a kid late last year from um, West Liberty, uh, Andre Samuels. He looks pretty good. Uh, and then we look to get a lot of production out of Davon uh, Legreer and uh, Stefan Benjamin. They've seen to kind of step up as the leaders. Uh, they're really trying to coach the young guys and uh, get them to do the right things. All right. Now, uh, just in terms of the season overall, if the team's able to come together and you know do what we hope to do, you know, what are the goals for this year if we're able to put it all together? Uh, this, this team, um, with, with the defense that we have, we have a great defense. Uh, I think that our team this year, realistically, um, can make a deep run into the playoffs. Uh, if the offense, you know, we have to do a good job of holding on to the football um, and not make mistakes. If we can limit the uh, the dumb mistakes, the turnovers, um, then then I can see us winning a lot of ball games.